Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. This is Paul of the Daily Dose and we have another diecast news and update. So and today we will talk about the new cars from Hot Wheels. We have some updates on the upcoming Boulevard mix from them and uh, yeah, another awesome set from Matchbox. I hope you will enjoy this one. Let's start off first with uh, a couple of uh, Hot Wheels multi-pack exclusive cars. So what you're seeing right now is a 1971 Porsche 911. Always a big fan of this casting. This one looks absolutely fantastic. So you're yeah, looking good in the black and bronze color rail of the wheels. 71 right there on the side because this is a 1971 model. Outstanding job right here from Hot Wheels. Uh, the, the rear though, no details as usual, uh, easy fix and um, yeah, it has like a uh, side and uh, top that goes for this. No headlight uh, tampos also for this one. Then here is a Lamborghini Centenario Roadster in that sky blue colorway that looks good. The interior is all black wheels, I think they could do better but it always comes in this or mostly comes in this uh, standard wheels that they have uh, yeah details he detailed headlights detailed taillights for this one taillights for these Lambos just really slim <laughs> right there as you see it's just a line and uh, next up we got a Porsche 918 Spider uh, again not really the the most popular uh, Porsche from where I live but it's outstanding uh, mostly in here uh, from the Philippines we, we mostly or uh, the people mostly go after the 911 the, the Porsche I mean the the uh, GT3s what else the RWB Porsche so this one is always left behind I always find this uh, in the pegs but it is uh, a, a good looking car so yeah I love uh, delivery it's just simple but it hits the spot uh, yeah no no taillight tampos for this apparently and it does have like headlight details and here is a Honda Civic Type R this reminds me a lot of the Honda Civic that Matchbox made yeah a, a, I mean a few years back that one still had like, like different card art um, yeah th exactly the same color and uh, I think the matchbox version also has like front and rear details uh, for this yeah, it also has like front and rear details it looks really nice for a main line I think Hot Wheels uh, out did an amazing job with it, this one and uh, yeah I think this will be uh, a really hard one to get in store especially here from the Philippines and then um, we'll talk about the the update on the Hot Wheels Boulevard mix number one the 2024 Hot Wheels Boulevard mix number one thanks to T hunted blog for this uh, yeah this this consists of five cars and here are the cars here we have a Maserati the LB Super Silhouette Nissan Silvia S15 I imagine that will be the the best one or the most sought after one uh, in this set then the 60s Fiat 500D Modificado. Um, that will be interesting. We don't, I think, is that the first of that casting? First release of that casting? Uh, leave a comment down below. Then the 82 Nissan Skyline R30. Uh, still a, a really good looking Skyline. I'm excited about that also. Then the MBK van. Uh, the MBK van, I think, will be the peg warmer. Uh, based on my experience in here but uh, absolutely nice uh, mix number one here not the best we have seen uh, a lot better but we'll, we'll uh, yeah, based on the, the list of course but we will update you on this in the future and uh, quickly right here update on uh, a latest the latest uh, basic set from Matchbox. So huge thanks to Mac and Club for this. So this is a basic theme uh, set for Matchbox. 
uh, it's the estimated time of arrival for this is February of next year so this one consists of uh, six cars all in all let's have a look at each uh, this will include that 64 Austin Mini Cooper beautiful colorway uh, I uh, I, uh, I should say I love the earthy color I don't know exactly what the name of that color is but I dig that a lot especially for the uh, for this Austin Mini Cooper we have the Austin Mini van right there always included or mostly included in uh, their their uh, basic theme cars yeah, I like that one also what does it say on the side it's hard to tell because uh, the the photo right there is uh, not of good quality but again I will update you on on this one in the future then this really cool looking 2010 Mini Cooper Cabriolet also right there beautiful color also on that one and uh, I suppose that one has like racing stripes again I love like the realistic looking cars that Matchbox has especially on these Mini Cooper and uh, the la next not the last one the fourth one that red 2003 mini cooper s does that have like the solid black windows i hope it doesn't have it uh the wheels I, again i'm not a big fan of that i think they could uh, have done better then uh, next right here that orange uh what's that uh 2011 mini countryman so that is like the like the bigger looking Mini Cooper uh, I have seen just just two Mini uh, Countryman here from where I live uh, it's not that popular it's expensive and uh, I think uh, a headache to maintain uh, but yeah this is a, a good looking one orange right there black top one of the best looking cars uh, actually in this set then that white uh, Austin Mini Cooper right there is fantastic really clean I love the art uh, the card art reminds me a lot of the like there was a release like a couple of years back way back uh, like a premium I think that was like a Beatles theme series that included like like an all-white car and the, the card was also like almost all white I forgot exactly what that was yeah th this one reminds me a lot of that one uh, yeah pretty awesome matchbox uh, set I think I don't know the exact name of this set probably like a, a mini Cooper <laughs> set here yeah, of course they are all mini Coopers of different kinds of variants but yeah pretty awesome cars here I hope you enjoy this one uh, like the video subscribe and I hope to see you on our next episode and thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.